Jim Holly, Supercross Live on SupercrossOnline.com here down at the podium in Anaheim brought to you by Amsoil and Trey Kennard. Welcome back to Supercross, man. I mean, I, I thought at one point you were going to win it. You had it, but you know what? Hey, a second's not bad to start the season. Yeah, I, uh, yeah, I thought I had it in the bag, you know, and that was probably the problem. I, uh, I kind of quit racing that last lap and, and really tried to be uh, on the guard and, and uh, I don't know, I was just thinking don't mess up, don't mess up, don't mess up. And, you know, when you, when you get in that mindset, it's never good. So I, I did that and kind of messed up on the step up and Davey had a good drive and, and uh, I tried to come around on the outside, but it was a last ditch effort. But, uh, you know, he, he rode a, a really good race and, and I tell you, a second is a win for me tonight. What's, what's going through your mind? I mean, you know, I kind of go back to Dodger Stadium last year. I mean, it's almost been a year since you've actually raced a motorcycle. I mean, I know I've talked to you earlier and you had a, a local race underneath your belt or something like that, but it's not like coming to a big stadium like this. I mean, to walk away with a second. Yeah. I mean, was that your game plan coming in? You want a podium? Or, I mean, you, you, you came into this thing wanting to win it. I, I really had no number I was after. You know, I, I did not race since Dodger Stadium and, um, my deal was I wanted to go here and do my best, and, and I was just grateful to line up on that gate. And um, I, I tell you, this went better than I could ever dream, and uh, I hope to continue that uh, throughout the year, and, and uh, hopefully we can get a win. But I, I tell you what, I, I'm just grateful to be here, and, and hopefully I can uh, be there each weekend. Something else I got to ask you, I was talking to Davey Millsaps up on the podium, and Ezra Lusk helping him, Timmy Ferry helping you. How important is it to have a rider that's been there and done that helping you? It's great, you know, especially with guys like Ezra and Timmy who, who didn't really get everything kind of, nothing really kind of went perfect for them. They had to work for everything they got. And I feel like guys like that, you know, they, they know what went wrong and they know what went right. So um, I'm, I'm grateful for Timmy, you know, he's been there every, every step of the way, especially through this last little injury, you know, when I was calling him, you know, asking maybe, hey, should I quit? You know, should I be done? And, and um, you know, having that experience to go, hey, why, why don't you just, why don't you just wait? Why don't you just ride a motorcycle and, and have fun and enjoy that for a little bit? And then if you're not doing it, then uh, then don't do it. But uh, I tell you, that experience is is uh, is worth a lot. You know, me hearing you say that, I mean, those were thoughts that maybe you were possibly thinking about. Hey, man, maybe my career is over. Yeah, I mean, the first thing I, I told Jimmy Albertson was, hey, I'm done. And I, I don't remember that. I was probably a little drugged up. But, uh, I mean, it, it's such a difficult thing, you know, to, to come out here and think that things are going to go pretty good. And I just think that, that uh, I searched it out, and, and uh, I feel like this is really where, where God has placed me in life. And, and I hope to continue that, and uh, hopefully it's uh, tall to his glory. Let me ask you this, the, the track tonight got really ruddy. I mean, coming out of the corners, I mean, I saw like five and six different lines. Uh, it seemed like it, it was hard to pass out there. You kind of were just biding your time uh, following around Millsaps. You saw an opening, but the track was pretty difficult tonight. Yeah, it was. It, I mean, if I don't know if you can see this corner behind us, but there is like six ruts coming out, and they all go to the faces, and, and uh, it's like an East Coast round. So uh, I think just all the rain, and they put a good amount of water on it, but uh, it made the track difficult for sure. Um, the only thing is it made the whoops a little more easy. So um, I'm sure next week in Phoenix, uh, whoops are going to be a little bit bigger. There won't be as many ruts, and uh, I'm sure it'll make for great racing. All right, you heard it from the man who finished up second that night on that number 41. I want to personally congratulate him and welcome back. man. Hey, now it all paid off now, all that hard work, man. Thanks, Holly. Good job, Appreciate man. Appreciate it.